young white men are not getting the message as to why they should vote for Kamala Harris or support Democrats. So I'm just going to ask in advance, please like, bookmark, comment, and repost this to maximize the reach. As a straight white man who grew up in red states, I'm going to give my former young man self three reasons why you should always vote for Democrats up and down the ballot and why you should support Kamala Harris for president. First, pay. You will always get paid more and have better benefits under Democratic leadership. For the past 40 years, Republicans have systematically demonized and dismantled labor unions. Unions provide the single best path for a young white man without a college degree to get a good job with great benefits. Second, let's be honest, it's way more attractive to young women. 60 to 70 percent of young women are going to vote for Kamala Harris. They view support for President Trump as an immediate disqualifier. This isn't because of a difference of beliefs or because they're man-haters. It's far simpler than that. Trump verbally and physically abuses women and he's cheated on every wife he's ever had. You're going to assume that you might share those behaviors. Third reason is reproductive freedom. Young men are boiling with hormones. They make a lot of dumb mistakes, especially if alcohol is involved. If you get ahead of yourself or your contraception fails and you get a young woman pregnant, don't you want to be able to have a conversation with her, have some actual choices? If you decide together to keep the pregnancy but something goes terribly wrong and she needs an emergency abortion to save her life, don't you want that to be a choice? If you do decide to keep the child and you end up getting married and you have a family, don't you want to support the party that's going to ensure that no matter what happens to you, no matter how much money you make, your child is always going to be housed and have food? If you're injured on the job and can't work, or if your wife gets a cancer diagnosis, don't you want the party that's going to help take care of your family? Republicans took away all of the best paths for you to become successful, and then they told you to blame any failures on women or minorities, but really the blame only sits with one group of people, Republican leaders. To summarize, if you like money, if you like benefits, if you like women, you like freedom, there's only one possible choice, and that's Kamala Harris.